This is the B-24 Consolidated Liberator, War Corps heavy bomber from World War II. My interest in this is that my father, F.J. Lister, for the Royal Australian Air Force, was an electrician on this model bomber on lease to the Australian Air Force from the United States. Just to give you some background, the iconic heavy bomber you'd recall from the great movie 12 o'clock high with Gregory Peck was the B-17 Fortress. I highly recommend that movie. Another more later model, more advanced, was the B-29 Super Fortress. This particular model, more than 14,000 units were made, making it the most produced heavy bomber in history. So let's go around the horn. Let's start in the rear. Here you see the rear turret. There are more than a thousand pieces in this model and many of the parts are anatomically correct, including the fact that the, the turrets move. Here you see the authentic decals modeled on an actual um, plane. On the side you see the door with the side gunner and here the propellers. There's a dorsal gunner, the cockpit. If you could see inside the cockpit you'd see uh, actual instrument panel and pretty accurate. Here at the front is the front gunner. Underneath you'll see here this is the ball turret. The bomb bay with eight 1,000 pound bombs and it was front weighted so there's a wheel in the front it landed with its weight on the front. Uh, I want to draw your attention to these linear items structures just below each engine they're called the supercharger and that is what my father worked on. The supercharger was a series of pipes that circled around each other and put the cooler air from outside the plane in contact with the hot exhaust air thus increasing the temperature of the outside air being funneled into the engine made the engine operate more efficiently at higher altitudes. Let's come around and look at the emblem of the plane. You can see here where my thumb is, the emblem of this particular model was the Red Raiders. When I purchased this model, I didn't realize that I'd get such an interesting um, emblem, and that's because the Red Raiders was the emblem of the 22nd Bombardment Group that flew down to Australia from the United States with a number of squadrons. They flew out of Queensland in the northeast of Australia. They flew out of Darwin and Borneo, exactly where my father was. So he would have been working in concert with this group. The B-24 Liberator.